I think it's utterly pathetic that he would be doing this. Uncle John has put in a lot of time, a lot of work. Right, we, get it, we get it. We get it. We get it. Carterine HCG. Super oh, that is that is a peak. Seven. The the form of peak masculinity right here. Just so all of you know, take notes, everybody. This is peak masculine uh, physique right here. It's an anti. You know, this is a, this is the guy that's going to defeat Levon right here. Test sucks. Watch out. In MK six seven seven. He's talking about a bunch of SARMs right now. Gren, liquid anadrol, DHB, primavolin, carterine, HCG, superdrol. When I, when I meet someone for the first time, I'm like, oh, shit, you're taller than I thought you were. You're thicker than I thought you were. I, I, oh, that reminds me. You remember? You guys remember seeing that after pull video with uh, Gabriella and Ryan Bowen where Gabriella pinned Ryan? That was fucking hilarious. I don't have that. <laughs> if I think of Sandra's as recent opponents, if, if you were to measure Matarangi relative to someone like Chance Shaw, um, for instance, like I would say Chance would get. <laughs> and this is from six months ago and Sanders is only better now. So holy shit, was he wrong about that on this? Because this is when Lachlan and Sanders were about to have a match. Murdered, absolutely murdered. It would, it would be flash pins like crazy. Having, knowing what they both feel like in terms of stylistic, as a, as a relative guy, like honestly, it would be a terrible matchup those two. He would, he would destroy Chance. Australia has always been told, ah, oh, we're just down there. This will be the first country uh, formally crossed off the list that Australia has surpassed. The 90 kilo world title is the firm goal. I, um, What's your time I don't think I'm that far off. I don't think I'm that far off. I feel like I should stomp Ray. To, to be able to show the... Well, that did not happen, as we saw. I mean... You guys remember that match against Ray with Ryan Bowen? He Ryan Bowen looked so depleted. I think he had to cut to make weight. I forget the exact weight he had to make, but he he looked so much smaller. Like he's been training. He looks a lot bigger now. He looks like in a much better shape, and he's been acting a lot less delusional, if you will. The, the world and the sport that oh yeah, look, that's my that's the level. I think I should be able to stomp, bro. Right? I think the schoolboy will do it easy. In fact, like honestly, I think Harley would be better off facing me. I think he's in my level. Uh, and, and probably, look, to be honest, if it went in a hook against me, Carla, would lose. Delusional Bowen. Oh, let's read this. One to two years, he wants to win his weight at Zlati. Well, that didn't happen. Three or five years, recognized number one in the world as weight. Not quite there. Number one in the world overall. Oh, man. That's, that is... You, you got to beat Levon. You got to beat guys like Dennis. Genetics are a huge factor, huge, huge factor. I I think it's awesome, Ryan Bowen's like um, his intensity and his focus. Like he's really dedicated. But man, to be number one in the world at a, in a sport like arm wrestling, especially nowadays with the the talent pool increased so much, it's very, very difficult. And there's a huge genetic factor. Delusional Ryan Bowen. I feel like. So Sweden Arm Wrestling Television said he earned a lot of money from Ray versus Bowen. Oh yeah, was that on State Kings or what? We're getting in delusional territory here. A lot of you understand where the level is by competing a bunch and going to tournaments. Yeah, Stuff all of our asses like we're magicians. We're like, this is my level. Get deal with it. I said it on YouTube video. <laughs> Ryan had no response to that one. My honest position on the delusional series is this. Like, how do you look at those series? It is a series that makes deliberate negative efforts to ruin my reputation. Oh, they, they, yeah, yeah. This is when he made, like, a post where it was, like, you know, you know saying, like, delusional series is, like, bad or whatever. And then he's in an interview he said, um, what did he say? Like, oh, it's good. It's good publicity. Who cares? Or whatever. They're pretty good. They make me laugh. For the reward yeah. of internet popularity. It deliberately and grossly avoids and manipulates context. State Kings? Ooh, okay. That seems like a score there, Sweden Arm Wrestling Television. What's your name, by the way? I don't think I know your name. So I can call you by your name instead of saying your whole username every time I address you. To maximize the appearance of contradiction. I have zero. Ray was so good in the buildup. Yeah, he was. His trash talk is is not bad. I will say. Time or respect for it. Oh, boo hoo! Let me play a sad song for you on the world's smallest violin. <laughs> 